on the second day of Grant Noble and Denneth Azar's bail hearing. Investigating officer Charles Hwakoseb testified and opposed bail. He told the court that the South African accused Azar had deleted potential evidence from one of his phones shortly before he was arrested in June. Forensics reportedly discovered a military encryption application on the phone, which is used to delete information. The investigator further charges that four men allegedly approached two clearing agents at the harbor and offered bribes of 500000 and $1 million for the drugs to be removed from the container. It was also revealed that the Brazilian company which the accused ordered the printing paper from is not a stationary business but rather food business. Representing one of the accused, lawyer Sisana Manje questioned the grounds on which the state is opposing bail, saying evidence from the investigator is inadmissible as it was allegedly obtained unlawfully. In addition, Namanje says the police failed to obtain a search warrant when they searched the container. Namanje further argued that the magistrate was given wrong information to issue the warrant and that Nampol has dirty hands for allegedly committing fraud. The case was postponed to the 3rd September for another witness to testify and judgment on bail will be delivered on the 7th. Renata Rengura, NBC News, Valfes Bay.